Okay, it can be inferred, so we're dealing with an inference question, it can be inferred from the passage that an animal is less intelligent than the mammals discussed in the passage. So where are we dealing? What part of the passage are we dealing with? Animals that aren't as intelligent as mammals. And I remember the poor little lizard here snapping his tongue instinctively away. And that's important because that's where we're looking for the answer. It says here in line 31, a little bit beyond the lizard, using past events as a framework, the large mammal predator is working out a relationship between movement and food. So the mammal relies on the past. And that's, of course, different. Again, this line is coming right after the lizard as an example, or a reptile in general. The reptile isn't able to focus on the past the way that the mammal does over here. And so there is our key difference. The past experience, this is answer choice A now, is less helpful in ensuring survival. Now, however, you may want to look at some of the other answer choices just to see why they don't work, starting with answer choice B. Attention is more highly focused. This is an example of mammals versus less intelligent species like the lizard. And then here, if we look for look at D, there is less need for competition among species. If you chose this as an answer, you're definitely inferring too much. We know there's a lot of competition between the predator and the prey here in mammals, but do we know anything more about less intelligent animals, that they do not need competition as much? Well, you could argue that, yeah, well, they don't need competition as much. That's why they're not as intelligent. But if you're doing that, you're going beyond the scope of the passage. You really, That's really not warranted because you don't truly know that, and it's definitely not based on the passage, so the answer is A.